love EDF. Just so I, you know, I love it. It's just I, your eyes oh. glaze over whenever we play it, though. A little bit. Oh, after you guys were done playing EDF last time, I was like, okay, time to go. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, leave me. Time. Okay, I'm a, I'm a so, sleepy. So uh -huh. in, in this past thing, thing, there's Psychops, and they were patting around this place, and they got this intricate. I was a druid. You're a druid. They got this intricate idea of. Well, we're going to, they're hungry. They're starving Cyclops. So we're going to poison this meat and then we're going to give it to them. And they spent, uh, I got, uh, I swear, like an hour, mm -hmm. like doing this intricate plan. And then other people were like, you know, finding ways to infiltrate and do this. And so mm -hmm. finally, I was like, I have spike stones. They cover probably about like a mile. It was yeah. a huge. It was a huge radius. Yeah. It killed all of them. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, here's what happened. And it was it, a here, here's another way. Of, here's another way of wording that. We all worked together to come up with a plan that we could all do and have an equal part in and feel really okay. good about. <laughs> and then Vanessa remembered that she had a spell and just went ahead and cast it. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. But she didn't want her boss monster to die, so she made it have fly. Okay. <laughs> yeah. She handled that well. I guess honestly, they were kind of fucked. They were really because it's the one where they can't see the spikes at all. I mean, that's that's Unless a real they're a rogue. That's a real ball buster. You know what I mean? And then they walk on them, and they're like, "Oh, there's spikes here. That hurt. Let me walk over Wait, here." Doesn't she make us oh, some no. bacon? No, I asked. She said she only did butter. What are, what are green, green, green beans. Gravy. Oh. Just green beans. Green beans. But no, Eat them it's green just beans. butter. I made sure she quit using bacon grease because she uh, never knows whenever you're gonna come over and eat. Everything is kosher. No, but so she, she no, come on. That's what she told me tonight. I thought it was. Adorable. It's got to be because like it's you can't if you eat bacon all the time or bacon grease, you're gonna die at the age of forty. Maybe my mom <laughs> just, already maybe on my borrowed mom time. Just loves you. What's wrong with bacon grease? Hmm. It's, it's delicious. Can't have it. It's because he he's mewish. 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 Do it. Your cat. Ashamed. Oh Your my cat. god, what did he say? He said something the other day, something about put it in the mouth, and I'm like, just like the rabbi. Just oh like, my god. Just like what? <laughs> the rabbi? Yeah, the I made something up. Oh, yeah, do it in Palatio. Yeah. Everyone loves a joke, James. <laughs> I was like, thank you, James. <laughs> Everyone's bringing your joke into the fucking pew. <laughs> oh god, oh god. Don't die. It's okay. It's okay. Just take it out of your mouth. <laughs> Unlike the rabbi? Is that what yeah. you're going to say? Uh -huh. I'll kill you. <laughs> he apparently will, but he'll die first. I gotta call my rabbi and let him know that joke. That's just, I got to. I keep meaning to call. It's been like a year. You should really call. <laughs> you should really call, but don't do you, die. Do you call your rabbi? Just a talk. Is that, is that a thing? I, yeah, he's a nice guy. I love him. Okay. Yeah. Um, the guy who was at our wedding wasn't my rabbi. Is the it, rabbi I wanted because, already had a wedding he, up in Pennsylvania. Is it because he, he put his <laughs> First and foremost, no. <laughs> what rabbi did put on his... That, okay, that didn't happen. <laughs> um, because it's 2015, 16. It was 1980 fucking 6, and I'm pretty sure everyone was not okay with guys putting their mouth on baby dicks or whatever. I don't really know about that. Are you sure? <laughs> well, we're not, um, we're not Hasidic, and we're not uh, conservative, so, mm. you know, kind of unusual, mm -hmm. you know. You should go get your pizza and just smear it all over. <gasps> all That'd over. be so good. No, I don't think it would. And why would you suggest it? We were friends. I wanted to see it. No. <laughs> Let's buy some disposable thongs for uh, James to have. No. Why, why disposable? Like, yeah. Why disposable? Like, why not edible? Mm. Um, disposable so that like you could wear them, and then they burn them, throw them away. <laughs> why would I want them? Want to throw it away? Because How much are they? Oh, look, three dollars. Jeez, four dollars. Okay, sure. Yeah, for a twelve count. Are they leaves? <laughs> Are they leaves? No, Are they're they made of leaves. They're like stretchy with like, I don't know how to explain it. That who the hell would want a disposable thong? Okay, so if you're getting like a spray tan, this is the only instance I can think of. Okay, but if you're getting a spray tan, okay, and like you don't want to be just butt ass naked in front mm -hmm. of them, I feel like you should because oh. you're getting a tan. You might as well just go for it. <laughs> Commit. <laughs> but yeah, I wore I wore a thong when I got my spray tan that mm. I immediately washed off because that should washed be. off. I know. Well, if you let it sit, it darkens your skin and blah, blah, blah. But, like, I was at the mm -hmm. point, like, mm -hmm. I didn't have anything on my boobies. You didn't so, have anything like, on I'm boobies? sitting there and I'm scratching because I was itchy. 
because it made me itchy. And I looked down and like I have it under my nails and it was like scratching off because I was sweating. It was gross. So I was like, I have to wash this crap off. It's nasty as shit. Mm. But some kids got some uh, some practice in and doing doing their stuff because the students doing it. And so it's off yeah. sauce. Eh. Are you? I feel like we can turn this up a bit. Just a bit. Just. Are oh, you seeing the bobs? It's not bobbing enough. Yeah. Can you ah, well, I'll make sure bob it bobs a bit more. We bobbing. Bob. Is it, is it because? Oh, so my friend that was watching apparently he was asking questions. About what? Pathfinder on Friday. Oh. Was he asking questions? I don't know. He said he was asking some questions, but he said the only character that he remembered was Bob. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, he has a few. Qu- yeah, he, he has a couple questions. I answered him. Yeah, he's he found Rocket League. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. So <laughs> which is a lot like found people League. finding like, Jesus. Yeah, I was about to say like, did he just like find Rocket League like people find Jesus like yeah God. in jail? Well, they just released <laughs> it in a um, for the Xbox. Oh. So okay. he has an Xbox. That's sad. We should really tell him about Xbox and bring him to the light of the PS4. <laughs> I tried to tell him, I mean, dude. the PC Master Race. <laughs> well, yeah. But, okay, here's my issue with PC Master uh, Race bullshit. All mm-hmm. right? It's expensive? No. Price is nothing. It's mm-hmm. a goddamn hobby having a computer. Yeah. You have to upgrade this. You got to do this. You got to mm-hmm. patch this. You got to, oh my fucking God, <laughs> update my drivers. I mean, can't I just have a box that plays games? Oh, wait. Well, you can have a Steam machine. Do you want a? I want a real oh, box. Yeah. I know. Real <laughs> yeah. Do you want a forty dollars tweezer? Mm. It's Swiss made. Does it pull the hairs out painlessly? No. But it is a Swiss do, made tweezer. Do you do oh boy? Do you do uh, like nose hair? Not, Not really. No. Hasn't hasn't been a thing yet. Well, I mean, Not like, really. look, his mustache is like growing out of his nose. Well, I mean, <laughs> like, 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 mustache man. Mm-mm. <laughs> I have hair like I had a hair like this growing mm-hmm. out of my nose. I was like, I can't. Well, I was just like picking one of like my uh, my my mustache here. I was like, that didn't come from my face. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's so crazy. Oh God! <laughs> With a unique kind of sensation that comes with that. Yeah. Mmm. Holy moly! Get a little teary eyed. Like I didn't get teary eyed. I was. Just, it was oh. more of a oh. <laughs> Oh. It has a book. I pulled one that I swear to God would attach my brain stem. I was like, oh my god! <laughs> I've made a mistake. That was the master hair. <laughs> no wonder you can't think anymore. Mm-mm. You stole Pretty much brain it. dead. So uh during Pensacon, we uh we played the new the uh Star Wars Edge of the Empire RPG. Yeah. The tabletop. Mm-hmm. Have you played it before? Mm-mm. It's really fun. It's the the system looks really confusing at first, but mm-hmm. once you uh, understand that there's really only four things on the dice that that uh, mm-hmm. matter, then yeah, you should be that game. Yeah, it's super simple. Just like uh, you have the way the skills work mm. is that uh, Ooh, you have your attribute points. Uh, the points you have in your attributes equals one oh, cat butt. d8. Mm-hmm. So if you have like a three in in uh, charisma or whatever mm-hmm, the mm-hmm, fuck. Mm-hmm. All your charisma rolls are going to have like three D8s that you're going to have to roll. Mm-hmm. Uh, the way they make make like ranking in uh, skills work is that you upgrade those D8s into D12s which give you better better uh, All of them or some of them? Results. Just, just per rank. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So you have like three in your charisma and you have like one rank in uh, like persuasion or something. One of those oh. uh, D8s upgrades to a D12. Cool. Cool. So that's pretty neat. Like, uh-huh. uh, so like, and then on the on the dice, you only have you have uh, four things that you're looking at. Mm. Mm-hmm. You have success, failure. Okay, I think four or I think I don't know. Success, failure, uh, threat, and advantage are the uh, basic ones. Mm-hmm. So uh, you can. You can fail at something, mm-hmm. but you can also gain an advantage to pass on to another person. Mm-hmm. What advantages are are basically like uh, d6s mm-hmm. that uh, you can just pass on to someone else. Mm-hmm. It's a really neat system. Like we we played it and uh, we picked it up real quick. Fair enough. Yeah, the uh, talent system that they have, like uh, you can just like there are talent trees that you can just like grab stuff from to. Um, you know, uh, make make a your own unique character, which I think is really cool. Just like you're not you're not like 
pushed into a single class. You could just like pick and choose what you want your character to be. Baller. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Yeah. It is really cool. It's like I like that there's an active really nice. system with rolling. Like, oh, I fucked yeah. up, but I can still like help you not fuck up. Yeah. Hmm. The uh, combat's pretty loose too. Like, uh, there's no like, oh, I'm flanking this guy. Uh, that guy yeah. is like, you know, sixty feet away. It's the distance is really just short range in your face, mm-hmm. long range, medium range, and all mm-hmm. that. Right. So everything just went really smoothly. Fucking Corey's an asshole though, because <laughs> I was playing God, the. God. Uh, I was playing the the face smuggler mm-hmm, um, mm-hmm. beginner class or whatever mm-hmm. the hell it was, and every time I would try to like lie to the stormtroopers, Corey would be like, "I shoot him in the face." It's like you fucking asshole, <laughs> you bastard. Corey's a fucking asshole. I don't know what, <laughs> like, he he. Kept, oh no! I'm about to trash talk Corey on stream. I'm not doing he, it. He kept saying, uh, "But I shot Again. first. <laughs> Just like you're an asshole. I hate you so much. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yep. I thought of three things to say. Mm. All of them are not appropriate for the stream because I don't want to record it. Me being a dick to Corey. You don't right. want uh, evidence of that again. Again. Only, <laughs> only if he uh, talks about his glory holes. I'll smash him down. I don't know. I thought of another argument for that, so I feel. Okay. <laughs> Maybe later. Where's AJ? I don't know. I don't know. Sleep, working. Mm. Let's text him. <laughs> Maybe he has his dick through a glory hole at the moment. Who knows? Probably. It's straight. It's straight. I mean, it um, must be straight to get through the hole. I, I'm really... Yeah. It really does, doesn't it? That crooked, the crooked thing isn't going to do. <laughs> um, mm-hmm. God, now I can think of it as a glory hole. I hate you guys. Why did wow. your phone buzz? I don't, oh, that was mine? <laughs> I don't know. Now we're going to check our phones. I just try hard. Check my phones. Yeah, that's right. Was it AJ? All of us are really checking our phones right now. Yes, we are the best. We are the best. Around. And I'm just telling Devin it. to uh, chat in the stream real quick. Just make sure that, it, that it's up, actually updating. Oh. Yeah. I don't know. You yes, man. I think that's legit. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, that was a while ago that before we again. stopped the stream. How's that what, uh, what, what are you doing? What does Henry Thor want? That's a brother. Oh. Why does he... Henry Thor? Why does his name Thor? Thorine. It, oh. When I transfer everything over from my old shitty phone, it okay, cut off know. all the names. Thank you, Devin. 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 Test one, I two, three. I have a booger in my nose. I think I'm going to name it Devin. Gracias, mm. Devin. I have a pain in my ass. I'm going to name that Devin, too. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's also your hair. Oh, God. That's, that's its own nightmare situation. Mm. Yeah. Uh, so how come you didn't go to uh, Pensacon? Um, Why didn't you guys go to Pensacon? Looking to the panels, oh. and there's nothing I cared about. Mm. And then I was like, well, I could go play board games. And then I was like, ooh, Waterlands. Okay. And then that <laughs> was my weekend. I don't know. I kind of felt something, and then I took a walk on Sunday and felt good. Mm. <laughs> I was like, man, I should have, maybe I should go. I like, mm. I think so, yeah, I think Sunday would have been the best time to go, because we were like going back-to-back panels on, on Sunday. Oh, really? Yeah. Anything good? Uh, we went to go, the last panel we went to was the Michael Roker panel. He's, have you watched The Walking Dead? Mm-mm, I've seen some episodes. Eh. Uh, Tyson's. Like, uh, you, that one episode. <laughs> the, the first episode. The first episode, yeah. I saw the first, and then I read the book. I read the, uh, the first, the first comic book about oh. this big. Well, you're insane. not gonna know, know the guy from there anyway. Yeah. Uh, he's like, um, uh, Merle. He's, um, uh, he's the angry brother of one of the main cast members, but whatever. Uh, he was also the blue guy from Guardians of the Galaxy, Yantu. Have you watched oh, Guardians yeah, of the Galaxy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Totally. yeah. Okay, I was just making sure there. Because <laughs> that look on your face we, was like, mm. we, we keep up with the Marvel movies pretty well. Okay. Yeah. But uh, yeah, he was there. His entire panel was, uh, he just got off the stage and just started walking around to the, uh, to the people, like ask, uh, uh, making them ask questions. <laughs> awesome. It was, it was, it was actually one of the most bizarre panels that we were we went to. I think that was a good panel to end the uh, the day off on because it was just so fucking out there. He like sat on some lady's uh, lap and just asked her husband like questions. Wow. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> we saw Cal. Yeah, how's he doing? He does. He still does stuff. Really? Yeah, he's uh, on a Nickelodeon uh, show right now. Like a show, yeah, a show. He's like a he's like a rapper or something, right? Yeah, 
And uh, he's, like, directing, like, uh, the kids and stuff. Cool. Yeah. Good for him. Mm-hmm.